good. I rocked um, I did Kerrang interviews. I did an interview with Tim Westwood. I think I'm probably the only rapper or the only person to ever do a rock show and a hip hop show in the same day. But that was <laughs> awesome. Had a great time doing that. Then to come rock London. I think it's gonna be a big show. And I just can't wait to do it. I got the Astro Boys with me. I got the Marmosettes with me. Another opening band coming on. And for the for this is gonna be their first show to do for London and then it's gonna be cool. It should be a great show. Always been into um, rap music. Always been into rock music. I grew up listening to Tupac. And I always had Bad Brains and Fishbone also, you know, because they were some brothers just rocking out, going crazy. I always loved The Clash. I always loved Kurt Cobain on the hip-hop spot. I always loved Tupac. I always loved Eminem. You know, just the old school, Rakim, everybody like that. You know, Tupac inspired me to be me and to, you know, just go crazy and show my emotion and show who I am and just to be confident about myself. And that inspired me to do what I'm doing right now, even though many others probably won't be doing that, like mixing the punk rock and the hip hop. And I'm, I feel like I'm just bringing it to myself. Even when I was on there with Tim Westwood, he was like, what are you doing? <laughs> he was like, what? You know, you know, but it's all new to people. And so I got to bring it to him, show him what it's about. When he heard the music, he loved it. And so when people hear the music, they love it. And it's just getting it to more ears and spreading the word. And I thank hip hop for doing that. So you know, when, when was the time you think that we got that, um, let's do rap rock? When uh, my ex-girlfriend broke up with me. She broke up with me and I wanted to scream on a track. <laughs> and so I couldn't scream just on a regular rap record. So I took a rock song and I sampled it and made it into like a hip hop kind of vibe. And I screamed at her on that. And then I gave it to her. And she hated it. And because she hated it, I knew I, it was good. It brought the emotion out of it. And so I was like, well, let me keep it up. I like this. Yeah. So after this, you're going to Australia. I go to Australia, Rock Soundwave Festival. And I'm going to be on the main stage. And I've never even been to Australia. So it's going to be great. I'm opening the main stage. So I want everybody to come out and rock with me. It's going to be crazy. So, um, Okay. <laughs> it's all good. You're doing good. You're doing good. Look well, at you. Are you good with improvisation? Im improvisation. I don't no. even know what that word means. <laughs> no, but. but you kind of, have you ever been in like um, a proper eight miles battle? Rap oh, have I been in a battle? Yeah, I got a second place freestyle king of Houston, Texas. <laughs> yeah, I got second place because this dude came on stage and he just, he was sick with it. He killed me. I was making fun of him and doing all of this. Then he came out because I had a nose ring at that time. He's like, you got a nose ring, blah, 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 and all of this. And he was like an older dude. And so since he was older and then he was clowning me, he won the battle. So I got second place. But I mean, I'm just not no proper in-your-face battle rapper. I'm more just a, I just like rapping and doing. I like to make my songs, write them down with a point. I can freestyle. I can get down in a battle if I have to, but I ain't just the greatest battle rapper. <laughs> can you, you freestyle know? now? Freestyle now. I don't even got nothing to say right now. <laughs> I can't make fun of beautiful women, no yeah, way. Come on. Let me see. All I knew is shine. High row is at the borderline. One time, you know how I got a rhyme. She asked me to rhyme, so I do my damn thing. Niggas, high row, freestyle, and I ain't got no blank. It's insane. Man, I gotta let it shake. I just got this from the fucking Johnny Cupcakes, and I wore it in the Tim Westwood. It's all good in the hood, yeah, it's understood. That's all I can rap right now, you know. Thanks for us, and um, I see you later. Yeah, see you, see you later. I hope y'all come out to rock, and they're going to tell y'all how it is. <laughs> if it's good, if it's bad, they're going to let you know. <laughs>